this is Debbie. Thank you for checking me out. Um, I'm new at presenting this via video, um, but I have been known to be very intuitive with people, and I have been known that my card, my cards, when I deal with them or when I shuffle, will resonate with people. I hope that it does. So I am working on, or I am shuffling for our Earth signs, which is Virgo, Capricorn, and Taurus. Generally what I do is I just shuffle until some cards pop out. Usually I go with a three card spread. Again, this is for Earth signs, and this could be for your rising, your ascending, or your moon. So let's see what these cards have. Yeah, we have a few more than that, just that. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we have nine of Earth, enjoying life's little uh, luxury, spending quiet time alone, successful self-employment. We have the chariot. chariot. It's an important achievement, self-discipline and willpower, public recognition. We have the five of fire and computing goals, bothersome details, conflict with others. Oh my goodness, we've got a ton of cards. We have the seven of waters, of water, a complex decision, the need to do research, stop procrastinating. Well, earth signs like their research. The sun, which is a happy outcome. Brilliant new ideas leads to success. Have confidence in yourself. The three of water, which is a celebration, a wedding, graduation, or birth announcement. The need to have more fun. And we have the night of fire, which is a sudden event that needs immediate attention. Time is of the essence. Think things through carefully. Well, we have more than my our normal three cards, which is quite all right, because these are the cards that you need to see. With the, and I'm sorry, I, I have a little bit of a sniffle here. With the nine of earth, you're actually... What I'm get what I'm getting here is and actually if you look at this we have our fire, we have our water, we don't have air for our earth. But I think this is basically you. I think that um, you like to have some time for self-reflection, you like to actually, you're actually somebody that's really great at being grounded and into yourself. And I don't mean that as being um, conceited or anything like that. I think you look at yourself and you know yourself. I think you know your flaws, you know your attributes, which is wonderful to do. I think also you're gonna have some decisions to do in October. But the thing is, the need to do research, you are, an, you are awesome at research. However, sometimes if, it does, if it's not something that you're truly interested in, you may not wanna be doing it. So stop procrastinating. We're going, you're gonna have some, uh, you know, some good times coming up. You're gonna have some partying in October. Maybe um, you're, you, know, you could be having your wedding, your birth, or you could be going to a Halloween party. I'm not quite sure. Um, I think you like to actually um, put these things, maybe not put them together, but you like to be part of the organization of these. So um, enjoy that time. However, with fives and fires, you know, you, you, there's gonna, you know, you, you don't want to get into that nitty gritty. It's kind of like, I've got the grand idea. Here it is now. I've given you all the tools you need. Go do this. Though that's more, that's more of a fire sign than an earth, but I think that's exactly what's going to be happening. With this, we've been getting this, I've been getting this a lot. I got, you know, I've been getting this a lot so far. Um, things are gonna move quick. And, some, and you know, something's going to be where it's time is of the essence. 
and you're going to really need to think about it. Like, what am I going to do with this? Um, what can I say? Maybe a job is going to be coming your way. Maybe um, one of these parties, Do I'm gonna, am I going to fly out? Is it going to be okay with work? Things like that. But it's going to be something that you're going to have to make snap decisions. And unfortunately, that's not something that Earth people like to do. They like to do their research. They like to take their time. And when it feels right, then they like to do what it is that they need to do. So, you know, with that, that is being with October. However, you've got these two major arcanas and the chariot is about movement. And this is an important achievement, self-discipline and willpower, public recognition. So again, too, you've got some decisions. You, you know who you are. You know what you like. You don't, you know, you don't want to come in on Monday morning and find out that there is something that your job knew about five weeks ago that needs to be done now. However, that could happen. Okay? You don't like that. You, you know, you're like, well, if you knew about this five weeks ago, I could have started this on five weeks ago. Be aware that that could happen. Okay? Because you're going to be having this movement. There's going to be this, you know, decisions, and you, you know, you do like to, you know, this is you. You do like your, you know, you, you, you do like your life in a, I, I don't want to say necessarily, well, you do like it balanced, but you like it to be, you know, like, I, I see you as, you know, Mother Nature going out there and feeding her rabbits and feeding her birds and, and saying, okay, all is well now, and I'm going to go back and to do whatever I need to do. You're gonna have you're gonna. I, I feel like you might have a little bit of chaos this month, not bad chaos, but chaos, which does not make you happy. However, it will all come together. And I have not had the sun for any of my readings. Happy outcome, brilliant new ideas that lead to success. Have confidence in yourself. So don't let, don't let the sudden. Um, you know, the sudden knowledge, this new knowledge, this thing that somebody knew about five weeks ago, you now have to clean it up. Don't let that, um, you know, get you under, don't let that razz you up too much. You know, you can take the, you can take control of that and you can get that done. Part of it could also be that if we're coming to the end of the year, that they all of a sudden put a big project on you at work. Or it can be, um, you know, if you're in school, somebody says, oh, didn't you know about that paper you have to write? Things like that. However, I look at it as the sun. I think all is going to be there. Just bask under, bask under that warmth and you can get it done. Because if anyone can get these things done, it is the earth sign. So I hope you enjoyed that and I hope that resonates. And if not, let it go. Check out some of the other ones that I'm doing and see if anything like that. Again, this is uh, my, you know, I'm coming, you know, doing this new without having actually a person in front of me. So I hope that this, uh, this, um, that you had some fun with this. Thank you very much.